go to our website at lariaicare.com for more information on the following subject. Do you or your child need glasses for astigmatism, myopia, hyperopia, or presbyopia? Don't worry. Refractive errors aren't dangerous and you're not going blind. Refractive errors are the most common cause of blurry vision. They affect 25% of kids and 80% of adults in the U.S. Refractive errors occur because the eye isn't shaped perfectly to focus your vision. It is not a disease and does not affect eye health. Your glasses prescription must be checked every one to two years due to normal changes in the shape of your eye. Usually, refractive errors are hereditary and often children are born with them. Glasses are the most common way to correct the blurry vision. Usually glasses are needed for life since they're usually permanent. Contacts are an option starting at 12 years old, but you must also have a pair of glasses to rest your eyes. Laser eye surgery is an option after 21 years old and the prescription is stable for over three years. To test whether you need glasses for refractive error, first we're going to take an estimate of your prescription using an autorefractor. The first number tells us if you're nearsighted or farsighted, and the second number tells us how much astigmatism you have. Second, your doctor is going to do retinoscopy, where they hold lenses in front of the eyes and check which lenses make the light go into focus. And last, your doctor will perform a refraction by asking which prescription you think is more clear. If your child is too young to understand this test, your doctor will just change the lenses until your child can read the shapes more clearly. In a prescription for glasses or contacts, the first number tells us if you're nearsighted or farsighted. The second number tells us how much astigmatism you have. The higher the number, the more blurry the vision. Zero is normal. One diopter is mild, two diopters is moderate, three is high, and five is severely blurry. Usually a person with more than two or three diopters should wear glasses full time to see clearly. In this case, it's beneficial to incorporate sun protection in the glasses for both comfort and to prevent the sun from damaging your eyes. If a prescription is high, it's recommended to set a pair of backup glasses in case your glasses get lost or broken. If a prescription is less than one diopter, since it is low, we may give patients the option of waiting to get glasses until they have symptoms of blurry vision or eye strain. Astigmatism causes blurry vision at both distance and near. Astigmatism occurs when the cornea is shaped like a football instead of a baseball. Astigmatism is usually hereditary, permanent, and doesn't progress much. Since people are born with astigmatism, they think their blurry vision is normal. Often, they say they see well, but they can't read the letters or numbers correctly. People with moderate astigmatism or more must use glasses full time to adjust and see well. Myopia causes blurry vision for distance more than near. Myopia occurs because the eye is growing too long. Myopia can get worse due to excessive near work such as reading or computers. People with low or moderate myopia may see clearly at near without glasses. If you have myopia, ask your doctor if it's best to rest your eyes from the glasses when reading or using computers at a close distance. Hyperopia causes blurry vision at near, worse than distance. Hyperopia occurs because the eye is too short. Hyperopia is hereditary, permanent, and doesn't progress. People under 40 years old can often focus the lens in their eye to see somewhat clear without glasses, but it can cause headaches, eye strain, difficulty reading, and concentrating. Stronger glasses are often needed as you get older since the lens in your eye becomes harder and more difficult to focus. Presbyopia is the normal loss of the ability of your eyes to focus at near after 40 years old. Bifocals, progressives, or reading glasses are the most common way to see clearly. Monovision or progressive contacts are another option, but the vision is usually clearer in glasses. LASIK eye surgery is not a good option for presbyopia. Thanks for watching, and I hope this video helped you and your family. 
click like and subscribe for more informative videos about your eyes.